Hello, this is Overlord Nigel. And HBK Adam. And we are in the ice cap zone, a lot shorter zone this time due to better editing. Uh, shorter, well, a lot, well, shorter than the Act 2 for uh, Carnival Night Zone anyway. <laughs> <laughs> now, welcome to the lovely scripted section. Well, the end of the lovely scripted section. Yeah, um, basically, you arrive with the cannon ball, uh, from the cannonball, and out of nowhere, this is where I think Sonic Riders came from, you magically find uh, a snowboard and uh, start snowboarding. Yeah, I wouldn't say that. Um, things like you may have ordered something else before this game. I can't actually remember. I know he's used it several times afterwards. Like Bench 2 being a prime example. Yep. Ah! A ring! Now, uh, this is the point where we were kind of getting desperate. <laughs> we, I was, definitely. <laughs> yeah, we, we had, as you've seen, not been having much luck with gold rings. And in Act 2, we actually find one, and Ben decides to jump up, uh, not realising we're recording, and um, kind of cost Adam the uh, um, emerald on that one. Thanks for mentioning that, because I don't think you cut that out. <laughs> I'm not sure. But, uh, long story short, here's... Uh, this one's one of those hide-and-seek... Uh, Missions that aren't that hard to get the uh, thing, but you've got to find them. Yeah, it's a case of noticing off to the right if there's four, if it's just one row of reds or uh, several rows of reds, which at points is hard to notice. So she's run up the middle. Yeah. But when you find them, obviously like this area, you know, you pick up a lot. So it's not, it's not a hard level. It's more hide and go seek, and the speed's already going up. No, that's not me. Uh, yeah. Loose of searching again. There we go. That's mine. Yep. No, nice it's and easy. This time, but there no. we go. But nice and easy. So it's just a case of being able to find them. The uh, uh, grey one, that's probably the hardest to do, actually. Mm. It used to be, I don't know if it is in these ones anymore. Can't remember now. It must be on Sonic 1 too, anyway. Yep, now back to the game. Now, the ice cap zone, a uh, little bit of trivia on the actual level, is basically an old um, air network of caves in the uh, mountains on top of Flowing Island that they excavated for mining purposes. Um, also, just in case the blue hedgehog turned up so he could have a good giggle in their graves. Um, they got abandoned due to the fact that, well, it was too cold and there wasn't much here. And they're all dead apart from that. Oh, they, it's never been said if they're dead, they just disappeared. Yeah, they have the whole thing in Sonic Adventure, don't they, with the girl being from the past. Did you play from the past? I can't remember, to be honest. I don't know if played. There you go, run through Sonic Adventure just so we can remember. Um. Well, actually, we do have Sonic Adventure on the list of the uh, games to do. We have, like, every Sonic game on the list of games to do. Uh, yes. I don't, I don't think Sonic Cars on it. A bit for short. I can probably do the whole run through one video. Yep, well, I will do Sonic Car then. Uh, but okay, yeah. Uh, I'm going to talk myself into that one. Uh, <laughs> for those who care, Sonic R coming soon. Uh, yeah. Uh, now these platforms are lovely, because uh, you can't... There's a platforms in here where either drop when you stand on them, or go up. So you got to kind of keep your eye on the uh, ball on this level. Somehow I managed to hit the box and not break the ice. Yeah. Anymore. I never went that. Uh, uh, now, those steams, you'll see them uh, two or three times. Or there. Easy. Yeah, they're basically there to freeze you up. Uh, which does cost you all your lives, plus makes you complete full as a block of ice. That's cost you your lives, right? Ring, sorry. <laughs> it would cost <laughs> you life. Well, that would be harsh. <laughs> if you didn't have it. <laughs> you hit by it once and lose every single life. <laughs> These all 29 lives by hitting it by it. Yep, we call it Sonic Extreme Mode. 
uh, back to this bloody thing. <laughs> you know, I go straight for the rings and straight out. <laughs> oh, just straight for the rings, actually. No, for some reason, I've seen we've gone to the middle. Oh, no, no, I think I'm, you'll I'm, find I'm, you're stuck. I think I'm probably trying to get out and then get right around the way. There you go, yep. Yeah. There we go. Straight in, get rings, leave. Let's continue for that's it. How long has got 50 rings in there? Let's continue. Continue is always handy. Ow. This thing's fun. You push it, you jump on, and off you go. Obviously, it gets faster. Uh, That's when it gets bored. Uh, yeah. Let's get faster the longer you're on it, as long as you've got perpetual motion. Or for yeah, those. I'm still looking for, desperately, desperately looking for that final bonus stage. Okay. Uh, for those who weren't there, which is everybody, um, Adam got really stressed at this point, didn't you? <laughs> It's like, where is this flaming ring? Uh, as you can see, this level's actually nice and sh um, well, slow paced ish. <laughs> Sonic <laughs> game, obviously. It's not going to be that slow. Uh, I want to look slow. Even this little pelt, this isn't quite fast, level, really. Yeah. It looks slow because I'm taking it slow. Uh, well, there's traps. Watch out for the traps, they are nasty. This is actually quite a nice little level. It's fun to play. The fresh, fresh air after uh, Carnival Night Zone, I have yeah. to say. Yeah, that but... Flame re that spring really annoyed me. <laughs> yes, but after Carnival Night Zone, traversing through hell with only a cypher as a weapon is a nice breeze. Such a reasonable weapon. Five points if you uh, can recognise that reference song as well. I do, but uh, I haven't been giving it away. Right, now well, I think we had a bit of fun here. I'm surprised I haven't sped this bit up yet. But, um, try to figure out how to get up there. there. You go. That's what you meant. You meant to hit the ring and jump at the same time. I think I was having problems jumping at the same time or something like that. I don't know. I didn't make myself into a nice block of cute ice for you all, so you can and see exactly how that works. Yep. Welcome to looking down. We can tell I'm proper searching at this point. Yeah, we literally searched every nook and cranny. I mean, Act 1 wasn't too bad when it comes to finding things, but... Hey! And down and we go. Down the bottom again. Well, not always the bottom, actually, which is quite handy. I believe Knuckles could break for that thing at the side there. I, wasn't, I mean, don't quote me on that one, but yeah, I think we can. I have a feeling we're going to have to do a Sonic, uh, the Knuckles version of this... Uh, I wanted to do his way through his knuckles as well. Depends how much you ask something, to be honest. Thanks. But yeah, if, if you guys want to see Knuckles uh, thing, just leave us a comment and we'll see what we can do. But <laughs> that's, that's actually with any game. If you want us to do something, whether it be retro, new, we'll t give us a shout and we'll see what we can do. Yeah, see if you have it. Yeah. Or if it's cheap enough to buy. Yeah. Well, here we go. First. Sub boss, and this one is called the Big Istus. Really? Yes, Istus. Oh God! Thank you again, Sonic Wikia, for. I hope you're not taking the mic. Uh, the names. Uh, oh yeah, dodge them. Yeah, don't don't hit the bowl. Let the bowlers hit you. They hurt. Yeah, basically, he pulls up big bowl, stable bowlers from the ground, strings around a bit. Yeah, a reminiscent of the Metropolis boss, then throws them about the place. Yeah, they like doing this. Um, having very similar bosses to past bosses. I think it's because Sega ran out of ideas, to be honest. I think there's only so many boss ideas you can come up with. <laughs> well, I'll say that. Uh, yeah, anyway, as, as you can see, it's pretty easy. He flies around, you avoid him. He drops boulders, you avoid them. You hit him. When his uh, defences are down. Yeah, normally when he just after he's chucked his boulders, is when he's at his lowest point, so you can actually hit him. And when his defences are down, yeah. Obviously, if you're supersonic, fuck boulders. Yeah, if you're supersonic, this boss will be over. That's point. I now remember a quick way of doing the kind of a night zone boss. What's that? He's supersonic. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's a quick way. What ball? What a uh, electric, I'm supersonic, bugger that. Yeah. But anyway. <laughs> Enough stabs at ourselves for that. Um, next to Ice Cap Zone 2. Now, um, uh, I think you just skipped a bit there. Yeah, we timed out. 
Uh, oh, from the beginning of the level? Uh, no, we had to restart the level, if you remember. Oh, yeah, okay, then, yeah. Uh, basically, when we were searching, we got, to, we found a ring, and unfortunately, Ben is infinite wisdom decided to cause a few problems again, and we screwed it up. Uh, so, we basically restarted the game, hoping, beyond hope, that we'd be able to get it again. Um, I That's think... That's messing this up, by the way. Yep. And I think this is actually the time that we actually completed it all in one go, found that the ring wasn't back there. But you still get to see where it was. Oh, you're gonna th I am, we are going to actually show him where the ring was. So. Yeah, yeah, see where it was, but there's no ring there, sadly. Uh... But yeah, now this one's a lot more fast placed, a lot more fast flowing, and it's actually a lot shorter a level. Um... That would be me looking for, uh... Oh, yeah. rings. rings again. So, uh, to be fair, anything short after the last one. No. One thing I will say, uh... Is the music in this is actually quite good. Um... Not the best Sonic music uh, I've heard. Oh, damn you, Tails. Yeah, hello, Tails, and your infinite ability to mess it up. He got up to the top. He, he got up there, it's fine. But yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Tails uh, do it correctly, he needs brings you up there, proper. Yeah. I, I think we're on a hunt still on this. Yeah, oh, I'm still hunting. That'd be why I'm going backwards. Also, extra lives never hurt. Uh, I think I might have been actually wanting to build up a bit of speed and some of stuff. Although we used it. Uh, but, uh, yeah, back to the music. Basically, one thing I do like about all Sonic music is that it gets you in the mood for the level. Everything suits, everything flows, and to be honest, it's absolutely beautiful. And here we go, backtracking. I think you're trying to get the top there. Yeah, I think I'm trying to build on enough speed to, uh... I managed to build on enough speed to go backwards and then lose some rings. Yep. Lesson one. Going backwards does not always make better choices. This and is what I turn speed. This is how to do it. <laughs> yep. And it still... It still wasn't enough. Yep. I can't remember what we do at this point. I think we go back again. <laughs> Yeah, you can see how desperate I was getting for these, uh, uh, yeah, some walls. I believe up there is actually where the, uh, ring that I'm we... I'm not too sure, actually. It seems a bit too early in the level. Yeah. I think you might find I go up there for no reason. Probably. But, yeah. So, here we go. I just tell us going the other way, game might keep out my way. Try again. Are we lucky this time? The answer is no. I think, yeah, this is the point where we give up. Yeah. I think I'll work out that there isn't actually someone to stand up, though. Now, I see below us, I don't know if you caught the old corner of your eye, the Robotnik boxes. Now, I don't think we've had the opportunity to see them yet. No, that's the first time you see Robotnik boxes. Right. The idea of Robotnik boxes is they are bad news. If you hit you. them, yeah, oh, they why work. I this way? Oh, I got hit by a penguin. Oh. Yeah, penguins fly off the engine to hit you. Yeah, they, they do suicide. Bastards. I felt a bit too excited for that bit then. Oh, penguin, no! Uh, <laughs> but yeah, um, basically if you hit them, it's considered to have been taken a hit. I think they explode or something. No, they don't. They just they dive right here. No, I'm got the, the bonnet box. Oh, the well, robotic boxes, but yeah, basically take this as if you had a hit, so you basically, yeah. Uh, Tails to mess up again. Thank you. Tails to the screw up. Okay. Yeah, I think I now want to try and go use that, or, uh, slow down. That's just a problem. As you say, this is a much shorter level when you're not searching around like a headless chicken. We've probably finished this by now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Actually, I think it's pretty safe to say that we, on later playthroughs, uh, or well, well, later playthroughs we will have, we we'll probably would have finished this by now. But yeah. Uh, uh, that elusive think... higher route again. 
we're going the right way for yeah that's where the that's where the emerald should, should be this is where Adam almost rage quit uh Yes, after this level, we did take a day off to have a rest. Uh, and this yep. is the final boss. Now, this final boss, let me have a look, is called the Freezer Mobile. How original. Um, yeah. Right, what you need to do is get on that platform and hit him. But the um, downside is that he does breathe this freezy, foggy stuff out. I think you. it's meant to be nitrogen or something. I assume it's nitrogen. That's. But yeah, as you can tell, it's not really a sequence of when he does it, so you kind of have to take a gamble and jump underneath. To be fair, see, it doesn't always work. It's so Tails can hit you out the boxes before you lose all your rings. Something I didn't mention before. Yep, um, always useful, especially in co-op mode. So, to be fair, in co-op mode, Sonic could probably be hurrying. Ha, <laughs> I'm hiding. Bye. Now you get rid of all that thing. That's it. That's not shooting back, as you just now find out. Yep. And he shoots out from the bottom. So what you need to do is let him turn around. Or you use the uh, invincibility frames. I'll go ahead and just then. Yeah. It's generally easier for invincibility frames. Yeah, but that generally means you have to get yeah. Anyway, end the level again. That yep. was a lot quicker. A lot quicker, a lot nicer. We didn't run anything to say. And now we're off for a snow drift. Yep. Right. Um, we hope you enjoyed this much shorter video. Uh, Definitely much if shorter. you've got any comments you want to put, feel free to put them in the bottom, any suggestions. Uh, please feel free to like this video and to subscribe to our channel. And to Facebook. Facebook. Yep. Don't forget Facebook. Yeah, don't forget Facebook, Overlord Nigel. Uh, so uh, we will see you all soon. Goodbye. Goodbye.